Comprehensive Sex Ed to me is being inclusive and creating an environment where people can be heard and made to feel desirable because I feel as if a lot of the sex ed that I've had or what little sex ed I've had just use this fact this factor where they're supposed to make us afraid into not having sex and it's not really teaching us how to protect ourselves it's more of representing sex in this way that if you have sex at a young age or if you choose to have sex in a different way than what media represents it to be that you should be ashamed of yourself comprehensive sex ed to me is mostly teaching people or teaching anyone about all the different ways people can have sex and all the different kinds of people who are going to be having sex and it's not just cisgender focused and not just heterosexual focused so that queer people can actually know what's going on especially because there's different kinds of protection that people with two vaginas would be using and if it was someone with a penis and a vagina and it's important because otherwise like people aren't safe if they don't know To me, comprehensive sex ed is inclusive of everything that you can think of, you know, from trans identities to intersex people, um, ways to include all kinds of stuff and to have the information that's necessary, even if it seems embarrassing, to ask, to be able to ask questions like, how much lube am I supposed to use? Or like, how do I actually put on a condom? What's the difference between internal and external condoms? To have a comprehensive sex education, you need to answer questions no matter how strange they are and um, how much the educators very often don't want to answer those questions. Um, you just need to be able to see it from everyone's point of view and answer the questions that they're going to have because if those questions don't get answered it can be deadly. Comprehensive sex ed is just normalizing all kinds of sex whether you are straight, bi, or within the queer spectrum it doesn't matter it's just making sure that everyone feels comfortable in their own bodies and having sex with other people and not feeling any negative feelings towards sex. To me, comprehensive sexual education is being inclusive of all genders, sexualities, and identities, um, ensuring that we are not just talking about P and V sex, um, that we are not talking just about cis heteronormative sex, that we are making it inclusive, that we are not just talking about um, STIs and protection and scare tactics, that we are including conversations on consent and things such as bodies and things about gender and identities and making sure that people are having these conversations.